Now that your figure's been drawn in proportion, I want to show you how you're going to add clothes. Um, the clothes that you wear are not stiff. They're fabric. They move. Um, much of it's soft. They also don't bond right to your skin. So if you look at my clothing, it's loose around my, my arm. It's loose around my body. So the first thing you're going to decide is what kind of clothing do you want? Do you want a t-shirt? Do you want a long sleeve? Do you want shorts, pants, skirt, dress, whatever you want? So we have your figure. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add a t-shirt. So I'm going to go in here and I am going to create a collar. So this is the collar of my shirt. Now what I want you to notice that I'm going to do is that instead of drawing right on the edge of the arm, I am actually going to draw slightly away so that the t-shirt actually looks a little bit bigger than the body. So I'm going to come away from the body and I'm going to not, notice I'm not necessarily making it look, it's not coming straight out and straight down. I kind of making it look like fabric. So I'm going to have it come across. My fabric's coming up underneath because when you fold your arm to your body, if it's close to your body, you're going to create this edge here, this overlapping of fabric. The fabric's going to come down and maybe come over and start to come up again. Now, just for um, the sake that you guys want to do a sport or you want to do some type of a tank top, you might do a little curve here, tuck underneath the arm, and then come down. So here's just like a tank top, if you will, or a sports jersey, and here is a short sleeve. Now if you wanted to do a longer sleeve, you would just bring this all the way down and you would stop over here. Now what I want to show you is you'll take your eraser and you will erase all of the body that is inside the shirt. So really all you're just seeing is the outline of the shirt right there. Now for shorts or pants, and again I'll do shorts on this side and maybe I'll do some pants on this side, we're not going to start here. We're going to come out over here. Again, it's not right up against the body. So I'm going to come down. I might come across. And then I want to do an upside down V. So an upside down V like this. Now if I'm doing pants, again, notice how I'm creating the pants. The pants have some movement to them. We don't want it to be just straight. And then I'm going to come across the bottom. I'm going to erase the circles I don't need, all the lines I no longer need, so that just my clothes are showing. If you wanted to add some little pockets here, you could. If you wanted to add a stripe at the bottom, you could. Now, what I want to do is I want to show you a trick. So I'm going to zoom in just a little bit, and I want you to take a look at the sleeve and the shorts. So the sleeve right here. So this is a fun trick. If you take I'm going to erase that line that I don't need because here's my arm right here. So I'm just going to make sure you can see that. I want to make this arm look like it's going up into the sleeve. So watch what's going to happen. I'm going to take my pencil and I am going to make like a little line that comes and touches. And do you see how I, I kind of went down towards the arm? And so now it looks like the arm, the arm is going up through into the sleeve. Same thing here. So if this is my leg coming down. I'm going to go in like this, and there's my leg. I can erase my elbows, those circles that I, you created to kind of show where things bend, and there you have it. You have your clothing. Now I showed you quite a few different things here, so you're going to add um, clothing to your a person. If you want to add pattern or design, you could certainly go in and kind of create some, you know, fun patterns or whatever it is you want it to be. Um, you could add pockets. You could do all sorts of little things um, to your clothing. And then you could add um, color with art sticks or colored pencils. There is another video um, that will show how to do tank tops again and then maybe a skirt or a dress. So um, you could also watch that video as well. So go ahead and um, I'm looking forward to see how creative you can get on your clothing. Become fashion designers, everybody. Have fun.